what's up guys today we're going to be unboxing the focus on flexible tripod 11.5 inches stay tuned before we begin please don't forget to press the like button it's free yay so we're first gonna start we're first gonna start by opening up the box if i can get it opened Now we're talking. All right, let's read the back a little bit. Flexible tripod, flexible legs easily adapt to uneven surfaces for compact cameras, smartphones, and GoPro cameras. Ideal for outdoor use, compact on the go design. The basics. Strike a pose, be the star of your shot with your flexible tripod. Now you can capture your victory dance at the top of that cliff or take a stunning selfie in front of the favorite downtown mural. The flexible portable design easily stows away in your purse or backpack, so you'll always be camera ready. Focus on the specs. Flexible tripod up to 1.5 inches, support to 11, I mean support to 1.1 pounds, aka 0.5 kilograms. Ballpoint with 1 and 1 fourth through 20 UNC thread. What's in the box? One tripod, one quick release mounting plate, one GoPro mount, and one smartphone adapter, which is pretty cool. All right, it comes in a baggie. Pretty small. Has this baggie. All right, let's see this. Operation instructions. Okay, so you get a nice little simple instructions on how to use it, how to use this product. Let's see what else is in the box. Okay, some screws. All right, let's go ahead and open this. All right, it's gonna be one of these. This thing, we still don't know what these do yet, but we will figure it out once we read the instructions. And this. And so the tripod opens up. All right, you can, let's see. These move, the bottom leggies. All right, these move as well. Let's see. You can do pretty much anything. And this, I got it at Walmart for 18 bucks. Let's go ahead and read the instructions. Operation instructions, flexible tripod. Congra congratulations on your purchase of your new flexible tripod. Your tripod has been designed to be sturdy, rugged, and dependable product and will provide you with many years of reliable service. Please spend a few moments reviewing these instructions so that you can take full advantage of your tripod's features and capabilities. How to use your flexible tripod quick release system. Release handle with rotating lock, which is this right here. Quick release post, quick release uh, recept receptacle. I guess it's this. Um, cut out for vertical shooting mode. Ball head lock lever, which is this. Rotate the quick release handle counterclockwise to unlock the quick release post for the ball head's quick release socket. Lift the quick release post out. Once it has been removed from the socket, screw the quick release post into the bottom of your camera. Then reinstall by mounting the post back into its socket. Rotate the quick release handle clockwise to secure the lock-in quick release post back in the quick release socket. To adjust your camera in various positions, turn the ball head lock knob counterclockwise. You can utilize the vertical cutout to set your camera to a, a vertical shooting mode. Once you have achieved your desired position, turn the ball head lock knob clockwise until secure. Make sure that the area in which your tripod will be secured clean, dry, suitable to support the tripod and camera. To secure your tripod legs to an object, take each leg of the tripod and wrap it around the item that you intend to mount. Make sure that each of the rubberized rings on the tripod legs uh, segment makes contact with the object. How to use the product. Attach your camera to the tripod using the quick release standard. You can mount your tripod in any number of ways or even use it as a tabletop tripod never mount the tripod upside down 
Product design and specification subject to change without notice. I just screwed this little thing on. There's no instructions in here that explains what to do with this or what to do with this. This little piece only came with this tiny screw thing and it won't come out now. Oh, here, it came out. Um, I believe there's a screw that goes here, which I don't have. And I think that was missing from my box. So I'm either going to return this one and get a different one. If not, then I guess it just came with this. But I'm pretty sure if this is in the box, then it should have a screw also. But I believe this is probably for the GoPro mount. I'm not sure because I don't have a GoPro, but... I think that's what it's for. I don't think this is super necessary. Um, I wish there were instructions to tell me what to do with, with these little gadgets. But from just from my own brain, I can conclude that you would screw this piece into here. So let's go ahead and do that. It goes up and down. I believe you will put your phone in here like this and then just lift it up so it can hold it. I believe that's how you do the smartphone. And then you can blog like this. I think that's how it goes. Now for the camera. You would take this off and then you would just screw your camera has a screw in the bottom most do this is the Canon M50 by the way so you would just screw it into the same little thing right uh, you don't have to do it like this you can just take the you can always open this up since it's kind of hard to screw on like that you can open this up move this all the way so that this socket will come out and then from here you will then screw it on because it's much easier to do it that way There we go. Now you would just put this back together. Like this. You put the little ball back in its socket. Right here. And then we just screw this in here. And there we go. So that will be for the camera and this is for compact cameras so let's see if it'll hold yep it holds pretty well see you can move it in different positions I don't know if it'll take anything much heavier than this though because this is the Canon M50, and it's holding it up pretty well, but I don't know if it would hold up anything much heavier than this. Especially if you put a lens on it. If you want to record vertically, you can do this. And then you can rec record vertically. Like that. Alright guys, that will be it for today's video. Let me know if you have any questions. Um, out of, I'm pretty upset that it didn't come with the screw that I believe this comes with. Because it makes no sense for this to be included without a screw that would screw into this. But maybe, maybe I'm wrong, you know? That's the only downside of this. Everything else I like. It's pretty sturdy. Um, it's pretty good. Again, that's the focus 
11.5 inch flexible tripod so try it out let me know if you like it and you know if you don't like it you can always return it so yep all right bye guys see you later